Welcome to the Soul of Islam radio podcast. I am Ahmed. And this is Ihsan. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh. May the peace, the mercy, the blessings of the divine be upon you all. Ramadan Mubarak, wherever you are in the world, may this month bring you nur, barakah, love and enlightenment. Ameen, ameen, ameen. Now this is a Soul of Islam radio podcast announcement. We know that we have been gone. We have been away for some time now. Brother Hassan and I have been extremely busy. We have been through some major changes in our lives and good things, good things, alhamdulillah. Um, but sometimes the creators or the hosts of a show or a program have to step away, have to take some time to tend to their families, their projects, and their affairs. And that's exactly what we did. But we did not forget about the Soul of Islam radio podcast. And we did not forget about you. Thank you so much for all the emails and the support that you have shown us over the past few months. And thank you for believing in this project. Now, we would like to let you know that the Soul of Islam radio podcast is going to continue and Season 4 is around the corner. But before we get into that and what is yet to come for Season 4, I would like to share a little something with you. Now, on previous podcasts, I may have discussed the dynamic nature of the universe and how nothing is static. Everything is experiencing constant change. And because of this change... Things people go through and experience transitional moments. And because of these moments, we have beginnings and we have ends. And that in itself is a blessing. And so for me, personally, when it comes to the Soul of Islam radio podcast, I feel content. I feel complete and I feel like my job is done here. So this announcement is my way of letting you know that I will be retiring from the Soul of Islam radio podcast. Now it does feel a little sad and you might feel the same way too, but I think and I know that we should take this moment to celebrate Because the Soul of Islam radio podcast has been able to reach over 120 countries all over the world. And through the guidance of the divine and his inspiration, this podcast has been able to touch the hearts and minds of so many people. And the fact that this thing is going to continue is an excuse for us to celebrate. Now, when I created this podcast with Ahsan, my intention was to share something that is very sacred to me with you. And the sacred thing or things are my own thoughts and my own reflections and personal discoveries that I have found and experienced in intimate moments with the divine. And sharing that with you has brought me so much joy. I don't think I can quantify how much joy I experienced by sharing my voice and opening my heart to you. You know, I get a kick out of thinking, out of meditating, out of reflecting on the meanings, the the essence, what is beyond and behind the veils. I enjoy being there. And I enjoy sharing that with another person or with a community. And being a voice is something that I will enjoy for the rest of my life. Now, I want to thank you, the listeners, for allowing me to serve you, to be of service. Thank you for this beautiful and golden opportunity 
And thank you for being there throughout the entire journey. Thank you to the fans that have been there since day one. You know exactly who you are. Thank you so much. Thank you for all the emails, the kind words, the emails that you send. I save them and I read them from time to time because they bring me not just joy and happiness, but a reminder that whatever we did here on the Soul of Islam Radio podcast was in alignment with the truth. And so thank you for that confirmation. And know that you are always in my prayers. We are one. We are connected. And speaking of being connected, if you would like to stay in touch with me, I don't mind. I would love that. I would love to hear from you. Uh, You can visit my website, ahmedsakamini.com, and message me from there. Uh, Also, my Soul of Islam radio email will also be active as well. So either one of those will do. And I ask that you keep me in your prayers as well. May Allah accept from us all, inshallah. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytan ar-rajim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. rahim I want to simply begin by thanking you, Ahmed, for really, truly your selfless work and service to Soul of Islam Radio and to our community. I remember when we first sat down and I came to you and we discussed the idea for a podcast and how we can offer greater value and service to our community, to the Muslim community, and to the world. And uh, it seems like such a long time ago. It's just over a year and a half ago, I believe. And subhanAllah, so much has happened since then. But most importantly, that vision, that dream was realized. Soul of Islam Radio was launched. And it has, as you said, reached the hearts and homes of hundreds of thousands of people throughout the world. At the moment, after three short seasons, Soul of Islam Radio is in over 150 countries, has been downloaded over 100,000 times. And really, none of that could have happened without your love and your support without your really selfless passion for this project. And I'm sure the community thanks you. I thank you sincerely from the bottom of my heart. And looking back, Wallahi, I couldn't think of a a better friend and companion and brother to have started this project with and built it with. And this is a, a difficult moment for me because sometimes change is not easy. And I uh, just wanted to begin by thanking you for, again, everything you've done to help make Soul of Islam Radio a reality. I also want to thank all of our listeners for believing in this project, for tuning in, for sharing it with your friends and your family, your community, for supporting with your energy and your love, your duas, your prayers, even supporting financially. You've helped us get this far. And yes, Season 4 will be launching, inshallah, after Ramadan. May this holy month be a blessing for all of you, inshallah, out there. And I humbly ask all of you out there within our community, within our audience, to keep both Ahmed and myself in your du'as and your prayers. And that you also pray for the continued growth and success and development of Soul of Islam Radio. I will be addressing everyone soon with another announcement for the future of Soul of Islam Radio as well as what to expect with Season 4. But the primary purpose of this message was to thank Ahmed for everything he's done up until now. And inshallah ta'ala to wish him well in everything and every project that he pursues in his path. Thank you, uh, Brother Hassan, for your kind words, for your support, for your selfless work, for the community. And I... Thank Allah for allowing us to experience these beautiful moments on the Soul of Islam Radio podcast. It was such a beautiful journey and experience and will always be in my heart. We have seen each other go through so much in such little time and it's so beautiful to know that we have that kind of connection. And I'm thankful that I got to plant the seeds and build Soul of Islam Radio with with you. Alhamdulillah for that. It was such an amazing experience. May Allah bless you and continue to fill your life with 
his love and his guidance and his wisdom and knowledge throughout every project, throughout every gathering, and throughout all the programs that you have been creating online. I wish you nothing but success for you and your family. And um, like you said, uh, change is difficult, but it is something that we have to go through in life, in this cosmic journey. I pray for nothing but success for you and your family. And from the heart of my heart, my brother, I love you. May we always be connected to the light and the wisdom and the truth of our beloved Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And may he always continue to inspire us to do his work in this world. And may we always be reflections of light. I mean. And thank you again to the supporters of the Soul of Islam Radio podcast. I kindly ask you and urge you to continue to support my brother Hassan with this work. The Soul of Islam Radio is like a tree, like my father says. He described it as a tree, and I pray that it continues to bear fruits of love, inspiration, and wisdom that others can benefit from. Allahumma ameen. You know, bless you, Habibi Ahmed, and that love flows both ways. Uh, you know, this there's a I love you sincerely and dearly as a brother, as a friend. And you know, one of the things that we've emphasized throughout Soul of Islam Radio has been the necessity of surrender and also the realization that life is change. And as I said earlier, it's not always easy to surrender to change, but Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the best of planners and He knows best. And sometimes we find ourselves with no choice but to have to accept change and inshallah to trust in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's will. So again, on behalf of myself and all of our listeners, uh, you know, thank you, Ahmed, for everything. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala continue to support you and bless you in everything you do and every project you're involved in. And to our listeners, our audience, stay tuned. There will be a an update, a message coming soon about season four for Salt of Assam Radio. Inshallah, we are aiming and planning to be back on the air live, inshallah, within about a week after Ramadan concludes, about after, a week after Eid. So this is Ahsan, and wishing Ahmed, my brother, as well as all of our audience, a blessed and successful, holy conclusion to this blessed and noble month of Ramadan, a happy and beautiful Eid, inshallah, with your loved ones, your families, your communities. Again, please do keep us in your du'as and in your prayers. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guide us all to serve Him in the best way, in the best capacity that we are capable. Amin. Barakallahu feek, Brother Ahsan, for your kind words, for your support, for being there as a friend and a brother. I am thankful to Allah for this beautiful, enriching experience we call the Soul of Islam Radio Podcast. And you and your family and all of the listeners will always be in my prayers and my dua. I remembered the very first time that you and I met, and uh, I don't think that we have shared this story with the audience, but Ahsan and I met in a circle of dhikr, a circle of remembrance. And subhanAllah, how beautiful that is to have started our friendship in such a gathering. And in that moment when we first met, we were sitting right next to each other, but our hearts knew that we were going to come together and build this platform. You know, before the Soul of Islam Radio podcast, I was in a hibernation phase in my life where I was just focusing on physics and that's pretty much it. But after that phase ended, I decided to step out into the community and connect with others to build projects and platforms 
And that was my intention. And alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah, Allah made that a reality. It happened with Soul of Islam Radio Podcast. It happened with Soul Expression Live, which is another platform for poets. Unite in the Light with the Sheikh Maryam Kabir Fai, whom we interviewed on this podcast, and other projects that I've been able to build and create with others. So I'm really thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for allowing me to connect with others and create things that reflect his beauty, his light in this world. Alhamdulillah, shukrullah. Now I would like to conclude this announcement by inviting you, the listeners, to join us in a very short dua in this blessed month of Ramadan. Allahumma dina fi man hadayt wa afina fi man afayt wa tawallana fi man tawallayt wa barik lana fi ma a'tayt wa asrif anna bi rahmatika sharra ma qadayt فإنك تقضي ولا يقضى عليك إنه لا يذل من واليت ولا يعز من عاديت تباركت ربنا وتعاليت نستغفرك اللهم من جميع الذنوب والخطايا ونتوب إليك يا الله يا الله يا الله يا الله يا الله the creator of everything the creator of the universe the creator of ins jinn and malaika ya allah ya allah ya allah we call upon you in this beautiful blessed month of ramadan we ask that you open our hearts open our hearts to love to enlightenment, to wisdom, to pure and true knowledge, to contentment, to mindfulness, to the way of the beloved Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Ya Allah, Ya Allah, clean our hearts from any attachments that we have with this world. Purify our nufus, purify ourselves and allow ourselves to ascend through stations and stages. Ya Allah, allow us to reach a point where we are mutma'inneen, where we have tuma'nina, where we are calm and content, Ya Rabbil Alameen. Ya Allah, we ask that you bless humanity, bless the entire family, the entire human family, Ya Rabbil Alameen. And whomever is seeking you, whomever is seeking you in this world, open a door for them, open a path for them. Open a way for them to reach you, to become mirrors and reflections of the character of Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. We ask that you heal the sick. We ask you that you heal the sick. We ask you that you heal the sick. Ya Allah, ya Allah, heal the broken families. Heal the broken families. Heal the broken families. Ya Rabb. Ya Allah, protect and shelter those without homes. Protect and shelter those without homes. Protect and shelter those without homes, Ya Rabb. Ya Allah, Ya Allah, Ya Allah. We ask that you fill the bonds of brotherhood and sisterhood and friendship with love. With love and love, Ya Rabb Al-Alameen. Ya Allah, Ya Allah, strengthen our bonds throughout the community. Rid humanity of evil. Remove evil, Ya Rabb Al-Alameen. I ask that you help us find the deepest aspects of who we truly are within ourselves and in our hearts. Allow us to reflect your beauty in this world and in the next. I ask that you bless the project called Soul of Islam Radio. Allow it to inspire and touch others all over the world. Ya Rabb, help and guide and inspire my brother Ahsan to continue to do this work and more platforms and more projects Ya Rabbil Alameen ask that you bless him and his family and all of his loved ones 
Ya Allah, I ask that you bless and guide and protect and love and inspire all of the listeners of the Soul of Islam radio podcast all over the world. I ask that you open a path for them. Open a path, a path of love that will lead them to you, Ya Rabbil Alameen. Allow them to overcome and conquer their minds and their selves and to reach a point at which they are near to you and to your beloved Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Protect them, Ya Rabbil Alameen, with your malaika from all directions. Ya Allah, we ask that you forgive us for our forgetfulness, for forgetting the day we witnessed you and we said, Bala. We said, Bala. Ya Allah, forgive us for that and allow us to remember that day, that moment, that eternal moment, Ya Rabbil Alameen. Ya Allah, allow our characters to emulate that of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Purify ourselves. Purify our hearts and fill our hearts with selflessness, love, wisdom, knowledge, the power of reflection, and allow us to reach gnosis in this life. Ya Allah, help those who are suffering from anxiety, depression, and fear, Ya Rabbil Alameen. And strengthen our himma, Ya Allah, strengthen our himma on knowledge, on research, on Islam, on selflessness, on reaching you, Ya Rabbil Alameen. Ya Allah, Ya Allah, guide us with each step of the way. Make each moment of our lives a moment that is in line with Sirat al-Mustaqim, with the straight path. Ya Allah, I ask that you cover this entire planet with peace. Ya Allah, allow humanity to experience peace once and for all, Ya Rabbil Alameen. Allahumma salli wa sallim wa barik ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa ashabihi ajma'een. We will conclude this dua, this prayer, by invoking the secrets of Surah Al-Fatiha. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. الرحمن الرحيم مالك يوم الدين إياك نعبد وإياك نستعين إهدنا الصراط المستقيم صراط الذين أنعمت عليهم غير المغضوب عليهم ولا الضالين آمين 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 يا رب العالمين To all the listeners, all of humanity, from all races, cultures, religions, creeds, whomever you are, wherever you are, from the heart of my heart, I love you. May the peace, the mercy, and the blessings of the Divine be upon you all. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.